<laughs> the best way to start your morning. <laughs> Morning! Swimming in the sea is the undisputed best way to start any day of your life. You just said that. It's so true though. Yeah. Wakes you up, makes you feel good. Gets the blood pumping. Who needs sleep? On the menu today we have two boiled eggs, one green tea, and one tin of beans to be eaten by two extremely extremely sweaty humans because it's ridiculously hot of gas. I need a new one. Oh well let's eat them like this. Are they slightly warm? Yeah. We're under attack by goats. They're going on our mattress. It's the goat. Now now. Let's not be silly here. Yeah? You want it with me, do you, Sonny? Yeah? You want a piece of this? What is it, gang? Yeah, that's right. You better head in the other direction. Is it, is it you turning to come from the other angle? This guy's got balls. Come on, goats. Come on. This way. Yeah, there you go. Off you pop. We showed them. Well, you think you're in formation, aren't you? Yeah? You want it with me, do you? <laughs> Ah. They literally pretended to leave and then they recircled and attacked all at once from another angle. So we were just driving to the wadi we're going to today and we spotted the geezers that we were trying to find yesterday. We were supposed to camp next to it, we couldn't find because it, it was dark. Yeah, we just saw them out the corner of our eye. Whoa! Look at these weird eyes. Weird, like fish eel things. What the hell are they? What the fuck is that? What's a crab? Whoa! Oh my god! Oh my god, so many more of these weird little fish. What are these weird things? They're like land fish. They look, they look like the first generation of human. Ah, oh, it's a hornet. So this is what it comes out of. That was good timing, wasn't it? Where were you hiding when that was all going on? I'm to get wet and dry, but you know, some of us got to drive. You're absolutely Tilly's finally so driven the car off road for the You're first ever time today. And now she thinks she's like Michael Schumacher or something. She finally worked like, out. Look at the nice feet. Look at that, look at that water color. She finally worked out to get it from a uh, park into drive. After about, what, four attempts? So hot, I'm not even in the water. You look shiny. And it just looks like I've been swimming. You're like a shiny Pokemon. So we've driven about, I'd say, 300 meters and already stopped off to check out this beach. It's called White Beach, apparently. I might go for a dip. Yeah, go on, you're already soaking anyway. <laughs> We've made it to Wadi Sharp and the goats. Yeah? I think there's just a lot of goats in Oman. That's the, that's the vibe I'm getting. Anyway, we're gonna head into the valley now on a boat and it looks amazing. They're coming from my back. Oh my God, I'm surrounded. They can sense your fear, they're circling you. Hello, Mr. Goat. Thank you. Here we go. Oh, oh. Oh, sorry. <laughs> it feels like we're heading into like, heading into like the, I don't know, like the jungle, the South I American know. jungle. The Amazon. Into the shop we go. Wadi Sharp. seems to be full of surprises. After one of the shortest boat trips of all time, we are Made it to Wadi Sharp. On, on route Wadi Sharp, which is like a canyon, kind of like Wadi Majib, if you've seen that video in Jordan. 
that you like walk it walk down and then it becomes a swim and then it becomes an obstacle course so yeah this is this is turning into quite a day isn't it yeah isn't it sweaty mess i don't know what's wrong with me guys Today's not adapted to the humidity here very well no It's nice and cool in this valley and just so green. I mean, look at that. It's, it's crazy. Almost reminds you of Sri Lanka down here. Oh, I think we've made it to the actual gorge. Look at this. Look at the fish on the top edge. Look at that water. It looks amazing. Get me in it. It's like the Garden of Eden here. Oh. Oh no, I'm soaking. Mm. Oh my god. It's so nice, Ed. Is that doing good things for you? Oh yeah. Let me get a hit on that wasp. You need to try. Oh, the wasp bag. Ah! Oh, well that's the whole point, Beth. Oh yeah. <laughs> good? So good. <laughs> vet operation. This animal, we need to rescue it. It won't move. What's wrong with it? Oh! I think it's all right, it's just chilling out. When I went near it, it like didn't move and that's so unlike a butterfly. Don't know what we can do for it though. We can move it off the path, that's I That's what I was thinking, but I don't know how you're gonna get it. Come on, Mr. Butterfly. Come on, there we go. Oh, look at it, Ed. It's just... Oh, no, oh, it can't it's fly. It's the wing. It's, it's the wing. wing. It's the wing. That wing has been split in half, oh, I think. Oh, sake. Oh. Don't know if that'll heal itself, to be honest. Uh, it's gone down there. Right, it clearly likes the rocks, so we'll just let it be. It's off the path, Look at, at this least. hornet tree. It's like Kew Gardens. It's honestly here. like Kew Gardens. The dragonflies are like the size of my hand, aren't they, Ed? Yeah, and the bees. And, and the, the bees. Not, not really that big, but, you know. So if you get lost, because apparently, classic us, you should do this with a guide, you know, those things that we never use. And so if you get lost, keep going and follow the black arrows. Apparently it's very deep though. We've made it to the promised land. This is where you leave your possessions and begin to swim onwards. Oh. Okay, I'm fully on. Oh, that's so good. It's <laughs> so cold. Oh, so nice. Apparently, cold. it's 15 minutes to swim. Good. So nice to see you. <laughs> A bird just flew behind you. It was so cool. <laughs> Have you become the bird now? Yeah. It's amazing, it really is amazing. I'm swimming for about 15 minutes, I suppose. And we're going to go through this tiny gap. We're going to go the loony cave. Yeah, we keep seeing people disappear through this crack, so I guess that's, that's where we're heading. Oh, oh wow. Oh, God. Right, so I've got this, so use this. <sighs> and just remain calm, okay? All right, Dora the Explorer. Just remain calm, everyone. Remain calm. I kicked that woman so hard. I kicked another one earlier. What, that's the rope we go up? Yeah. <laughs> Apparently, we go up that rope. No other guy, tour guide, doing it, but. Over there, and then we'll. I'll try and get up if it's worth it. Thank 
this person the lovely German friend who helped me get up there as you can see uh, and we've made it to this pool where Ed's was waiting for me Come on, jump! The sun's come out <laughs> As soon as I put my feet, because they were like, they were like this. Well, that's what I was shouting at you. No, you, you. <laughs> and then as soon as I put. You, them you, you had one like up. That, you, you had one up, and then one down. And I, uh, every time the one down was obviously getting stuck. You had to get them both up, then give all your arms, and then. You did it like this. But no, you made it. It's not easy to be fair. I mean, there's only us and three other people up here. Everyone else is sitting down there like. Wait, 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 wait. You can't see that you can get up there. It's only because there's ropes up there. Yeah. Well, I just charged straight into obviously. it. Obviously. I was like, rope, climb, rope, climb. You were like, rope equals, equals climb, equals climb. Yeah, you have to jump off the waterfall to get back down, so that's really interesting. But I don't think I can do that, so I think I'll slide down. I think it's safer to jump, though. Uh, no. Careful, Ed. Oh. Okay, so sadly we ran out of battery in the, uh, in the wadi. Oh. You didn't miss much apart from Tilly crying when she was um, trying to get down that waterfall. I was partly laughing and crying. But I was, I was very scared. It was terrifying. It was scary to be fair. Well, for you. Um, <laughs> no, but it's, it's slippery and quite steep. <laughs> yeah, basically we, we, we went back the way we came and you didn't miss much. It was great though, do it. And now we're heading on to our next destination. Apparently the goats here are just like wild dogs and they just want food all the time. Fair enough. Mm. Right, let's go. Right, move. That's what pays for all these nice roads and uh, lights and infrastructure you see in Oman. Black gold. Look at that oil rig. Smells like money to me. We're yeah, basically well. like literally running out of petrol so badly. One kilometre to the station. At that noise? Sorry, it's the window. Okay, okay. You're panicking? Yeah. Right, that's enough. Why, it's so cheap. So I was talking about the oil money. Here we are at the petrol station. It's 23 Besa, which is about... 40p? Four, nah, no, more no, like 50p. 50p, 50p a litre. We're close to the oil. I was gonna say, I think it's because we're literally in the, in the petrol station next to the oil plant, so maybe. it's like it's maybe even cheaper. I don't know, but we'll take. Hello. Waving. Thank you. All right, so we were basically on empty, and this fucking beastly 4 x 4 uh Mitsubishi Pajero. We just filled the entire tank for. Thank you. 18, which is like. 40 quid. Like yeah, 40 pounds, like 45 dollars for the whole tank. 75 litres. 75 litres. Crazy. Come on, eggs. Oh, mine's just too lit. Come on, eggs. What? Let's nice. go find some food. Oh, yeah, Tilly's hungry. I'm hungry too, to be I'm fair. Starving, Ed. Let's go get some lunch. Starving, Ed. Eddie's obsessed with the oil. Tilly won't let me hold the GoPro whilst driving anymore. Of so. course, I won't. Is that a football stadium? Oh, gosh. It's like Disneyland for you here. No, I don't. Oh, yeah, it yeah, is. It is. They've got a stand and everything. But what I was going to say. Back to you. Is that it's just like oil, oil field plant, whatever they're called, oil drills after oil plant after oil plant after oil plant. This is obviously where like all the fucking oil is because, like, yeah, it's just, it's, it's crazy. Like, it's like a constant oil session here. Oil sesh. Here we are, guys. Got some food. Bread. Parather, I think. This is some weird Chinese curry that Eddie ordered. Tilly Biri ordered it. I didn't. Biryani. Tilly did it. That. Tomato chutney, a writer, some yogurt, some bakora, which is so good. So tasty and homemade. Just delicious. Mm. More lovely Indian food in Oman. And these Human are cumin seeds. seeds. And I basically bits of sugar. This is traditional. I'm wearing a dress again. Indian cleansing palette things. Okay? So Ed is gonna try it first. You mean uh -huh. But don't swallow it. Chew and spit out. It's actually disgusting. 
tastes like licorice. Egg. Spit it out. I think I had this the other day and I swallowed it. Yeah, you did. And I wasn't well the next day. <sighs> It's honestly like a child, like literally touches everything, yeah. eats everything, yeah. licks everything. Yeah. Was it nice? Yeah. It's a good cleanser. Give it to me. It's like Nivea. <laughs> chew it. You want to chew it to get the full effect. You have a good name? Tilly. Telly. Yes. Yes, sir. Eddie. Eli. Telly. Eddie. Eli. Eddie. What, what's your name? Udayan. Udayan. Yes. It. Oh, is that just the sweets? Yes. So oh. I can swallow these. Great. Eating, no Thank problem. you. Mm. You try. Mm, I like that. It's delicious. Mm. It's like the cumin and the sweets. With Thank the you. Mmm. Very nice. I'll have this. Uh -huh. Good, how are you? Fine, fine. fine. And you? What is your name? I'm Masut. Masut? Yes. Ah, I'm Tilly. <laughs> nice to meet you. Uh -huh. <laughs> it's like being back in London, this. It is a bit. Look at the moon, Ed. Oh, wow. It's tremendous. So we're on the way. Uh, on our way to a turtle reserve. <laughs> called like Raz Al Jins, I think. Raz Al Jins. Oh, this is cool. Um, and basically it's a UNESCO World Heritage type turtle reserve. There's only six of them in the world. China, Pakistan, Costa Rica. I can't remember where else. But um, yeah, we're going to stay there and then we're going on a turtle walk at 8.30. Uh, keep going. Uh, here? It's, it's, it's here, Tilly's here, birthday, that's here. where we're going. Yeah, we're going because it's my birthday. Tilly's birthday, like... <laughs> oh, I was hoping someone was going to join back. I mean, first exit here. We better go because we're not going to make it for hours if we continue uh, doing directions like this. So yeah, we'll see you at the Turtle Reserve. Feels like I'm doing a music video, like... Mm. Oh, baby, baby. Do you know what I mean? We're on our so first uh, turtle walk. Oh, it's a 20 minute walk into the turtle land. desert, sea, beach. The beach. And hopefully we'll see some nesting turtles. I'm sure you can't see anything, but there's a turtle there. Oh, it's massive. Let's go clear the way. Baby turtle. 